What's up, YouTube? I'm Mr. No Name, or Max, as people know in the real world, and today I'm bringing you guys a competitive singles match on the map Solar. Uh, pretty interesting gameplay here. I actually pull out the sniper for several rounds. Uh, kind of redeem myself, if you guys remember the sniper video I put up where I got like four or five hit markers on the same kid. Showing you guys I can actually snipe sometimes, not always. I'm, I, I, I don't snipe for the team still, just because I'm the worst one out of all of us as far as sniping goes. But, um, you know, it's a it's a fun little gameplay. I left in one losing round just because I cannot believe this kid knew where I was. Um, I got this gameplay very, pretty recently, so I guess maybe he just knew the spot already. I don't know. But, um, you know, it, it, it's whatever. Um, then, let's see. So, Columbus. Real quick. If you guys want me to do a video on Columbus, let me know. Um, I can talk about important things that we learned from the event. Uh, some of the notes I've taken things to take away maybe something about which pro teams i think are going to be doing really good this year something like that let me know if you guys want to see it um in the comment section below next thing map call out videos i know you guys have been asking for more of these i will be putting those out pretty recently here i'm going to do them um, i think i'm going to put one out on tuesday and then maybe one on next sunday uh just because it's been a while since i've done them so look forward to that so talking about singles matches because that's what i want to focus on for this particular video today um live singles matches you guys have been asking for those i want to do more of those um i was very hesitant to play singles matches in the beginning of this game and i i've explained it to a couple of you guys on twitter or on skype if you guys have me added on there a few of you do uh, basically you know i was just kind of worried about how it would play i thought the exo movements would make it very weird and i wanted to wait for a little bit of a, a meta to form as far as how people played it I haven't seen a lot of people playing singles. I haven't seen really any videos on it on YouTube, so I, you know, I decided to just kind of bring it out there. I know uh, Nex plays a couple singles every now and then. Actually, he plays a lot of singles, but I, I haven't seen many videos from him on it for this game yet. But um, you know, I, I was just kind of hesitant to play it, but I've been playing it. Um, I'm I haven't lost a singles match yet. I think I'm like six or seven and zero. Oh. Uh, can't play on MLG yet for singles. Funny story, real quick, side story, is that my dispute and rep got reset and it was instantly dropped to 100% dispute and like a 13 rep. Um, I was at a 94, 95 rep and like a 1% dispute. Um, talk to the staff, the staff can't do anything, but I can't play on a team that has a rep below 70%, and so I can't play singles, I can't play dubs, um, I gotta play like threes or fours with some of my teammates that have really high reputations, get mine back up, and then I can play some of these. So I've been sticking to UMG for singles, I've done those over the past couple days, and, um, it's just been working out for me. I've played some pretty good kids though, I know it's UMG, but there were actually some good kids on there, one kid was like top 100 on UMG and then there was a kid that was like 24 and 4 or something and I've of course beaten them. I've only played one and dones. I don't play best of threes for singles just because it, it, I feel like it plays better. It's nice for quick XP. You know, personal preference on it. But um, yeah, I just thought it's been playing really well so far. So I feel like singles is on, on this game plays better than any others so far i've i started playing competitively in mw3 and uh, that's when i started playing singles as well i feel like this is probably the best game for it so far and a couple reasons for that number one it tends to play a lot faster in my opinion it just feels like people are moving more maybe that's because the game is still new not really sure other games i didn't play singles right away i waited a long time to start so maybe that's what it is also, I feel like it's harder to cut the map on this game just because of, you know, because of how the maps are designed so that you can use the EXO movements to get kind of the second, third story levels and everything. I feel like it's just a lot harder to cut the map. I feel like there's a lot of stuff in the way on the map. There's some maps you can still cut it, but overall you can't. Also, I feel like um, sitting in the spawn isn't quite as effective or camping in corners isn't quite as effective. This game favors aggressive plays and aggressive play styles so it's just been playing a lot quicker normally so um you know i just think it's like a lot more fun to watch and right there i threw in the grenade i'm used to running um two exo abilities so i just wasted my grenade like an idiot my bad there but um yeah singles has just been playing really really well um i want to maybe do a series on some map specific tips and tricks for singles specifically and I want to do a general tips and tricks video for singles S&D as well. 
Um, there's several things I've, I've kind of picked up over time here, and by the time I get around to making those videos, I'll know even more. Uh, uh, singles has always just been something that I've been really, really good at for some reason. I don't know why. Um, for those of you who don't play singles or just haven't felt like it's necessary, I, I think it's very important to actually play singles, dubs, threes, and fours. Um, obviously fours should be your priority, but playing singles, playing dubs, and playing threes, by doing that, you learn how to play in different scenarios a lot better, I feel like, and you can learn to work on your individual skill. Um, singles is all about outsmarting your opponent. You know, gunfights can be really easy to win if you're always behind them, always shooting them in the back. So it's it's a lot of learning how to play the game and learning how other people's play uh, really helps with your prediction skills. So I recommend that you play singles if you aren't already. Also, if you want more incentive to play singles, remember you get 5 pro points per win on MLG now. Um, if you play like 10, 20 singles matches in one day and you win just even half of them, well you should be winning more. But if you just win half of them, you know, that's, that's a lot of pro points you can get right off the bat. Um, and you can get them very quickly because you're going to be playing one and dones probably. So, you know, just kind of keep that in mind if you're trying to get some easy pro points. I probably shouldn't be saying that because I'm not in favor of the easy route in any scenario. But, um, you know, just keep that in mind. Like I said, singles has been really fun. I want to do some live singles. I'll start doing those probably next week. So, as you guys can see, we're coming to the end of this video. If you enjoyed it, then please like, comment, and or subscribe. If you didn't, then let me know what I can do better next time. Constructive criticism goes a long way, guys. Until next time, everybody. Peace out.